And hello, 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 and welcome back for some more European of Silence 4 Finnish Mega Campaign Fun. Now, I started recording just before, about two weeks previously in the game, and it decided to crash, but I did get the auto saving quickly, but now I'm back, so things should be good. Hmm, where do I advance next? Not dealing with um, natives over there. And I've decided to um, reform the Sons of Kelava army over here in Rival and Nava, because that's where I'm going to make them form. And I spent a fair bit of manpower as well. Oh, we'll get 100,000 manpower now. Yay! Got to replace a few troops as well, apparently. Yep, send them over there then. Um, take the prestige hit. I'd rather not get any rebels. Or potential rebels, I should say, if I can avoid it. Yay, I've converted Vladimir. Okay, let's have a look at that. Bit of Russian over there. Um, hmm, got a fair bit of Finnish spread around there. Don't, don't really need to spread Finnish anymore. I don't think. Or do I spread it there? Yeah, I might even just spread it there. Okay, there you go. Do, 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 I don't want to get rid of Prussian. I quite like Prussian. Prussian's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep Prussian, I think. Does that come under the Germanic culture? Oh, gladly honor the call to war. Okay, more importantly, can I get some potential territory out of that? Because if I can, I would rather like to. Now, um, do I have any claims on anything? No, I do share a border with Adjuran, though. So, um, hmm, let me think. If they've got stuff over here, we need a claim on this province so far, though, if I can. Wouldn't mind expanding my reach over there. What else can I get a claim on? All of those places, apparently. Where's Medanda? It's over there. I uh, probably should just get one on Cephala, I think. Oh, but this province could be... I'll just get one on Cephala for the moment. And can I get any on a Marne? That's what I'm curious about. I wouldn't mind getting a, a bit of a holding over here. If I can. I can't fabricate a claim in any of Oman, it would seem. Not surprised. No, I really want some of Oman. But yes, I'll honor the call to war. I've got to rebuild some of my own manpower before I can really be effective in that fight. But once I do build it up enough, it should be right. It should be good. Moscow, it's going to take forever. Okay. Do, 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 do. We've gained a core in one of the provinces. Good. They're going to be completely surrounded as well in the moment, those guys. I may not get this completely fully colonized by the end as well, which is a little bit annoying, but I knew that would probably happen though. So, that's for me to deal with. Um, he's getting sent straight there afterwards. He's nearly done with that colony. Good. Another colony's done over there. Wait a second, isn't there a fresh one to be sent over there? No, there isn't. Oh, that's right. I sent one to Africa, didn't I? I completely forgot about that. Um, do I recall them? No, I won't recall them. I actually let them finish finish that off. Um, is he waiting in Louisiana? Oh, he is waiting in Louisiana. It's all right. I can I can let that do its thing. Oh, good. Um, let me think. Let me think. Strange Short has a claim pretty much in all that territory. Sweden considers that theirs. Wait a second. Why isn't Strange Short? Or have I just not noticed them similar? Oh no, they still do. Okay, that's good. Until 1950, so they'll permanently have that. No, oh, I really, I really like the look of Strange Fjord. I'm kind of, I'm kind of, um, I'm kind of sad that they're no longer there. I really like the look of them, even though I kept, even though I fought them a bunch of times. You know, I thought, I always thought they were kind of cute. How much money am I making? A decent amount of money. And I completely forgot about this down here, and they have attacked me with a fairly large army. 
Um, damn. I could always send the sons of Kelever over over to here if I wanted to, which I might do. Do I have any ships where I could send them over? I do have like 19 regiments. Not 9 regiments, sorry, 19 ships. Where are they? Where do I send them? Um. Ah, that's right, they're over here. Okay, cool, bands. They're over there. Send them over here. They're not quite finished building yet, the Sons of Kelever. Once they are, though, I'm probably going to send them off to go campaign. Okay, let's rename them the Sons of Kelever. Three more. Still got, yeah, still got a bit to build. Okay, fair enough. That's building pretty quick. 120 a month. It's really quick. Did you pick a fight with someone? You did, did, didn't you? That was smart. And they're losing. Oh, if they lose territory, I'm going to be very, very, very annoyed. Which might happen at this rate. Ugh, why'd they do that? Uh, what are they doing? They've already lost a bunch. Hopefully they can claim more. they got a lot of troops as well. Like, a lot of troops. Shit. Oh, Cusco survived it, and so this place. Are they westernized? You'd hope so. Yep, they are. Are they Christianized? No, they're not. They're keeping their old faith. Respect. Decent effort. Same thing of Quito. As well. New Great Britain. It's so much greater than the last one. It's mad. Andalusia. Andalusia has... Colonized quite a bit in the end. Andalusia and La Plata. Interesting religion spread over there as well. How many more troops do we need? Are we building? We're building a few still. Once they're done, I might send them off to go campaign over here. I'd love to get a province or two over here. That would be pretty awesome. These guys still are this big state as well. Kurgan's rebelled. Oh, well that was going to happen sooner or later. Put them to the sword, I guess. Uh. So I don't mind if they rebel, because once I put them down, I don't have to deal with them again for like a while. So, they still got a bit to core as well, these provinces. I oh, wait a second, not long at all. I'll take that back. Forty thousand manpower. Is there any more troops to build? Yep, still a few. Jeez, I built I built quite a few, didn't I? I did. Yes, increase naval. I will take that. That sounds lovely. And they've occupied my one province of 48 regiments. Shit. It's a lot of regiments. A lot of regiments indeed. No mission selected. Boy, you keep giving me shitty missions. It's just kind of Gear man. How do you spell that? Gia. Okay, I thought that was going to be in Asia. It's not, though. Should I maybe go to war over here against the Huxi again? It's been a while since I've been to war with the Huxi. Maybe you could get some more territory over here as well. There's fur over there. Fur's always good. The problem is, is that they're still allied with the Ming Dynasty and Ki and um, oh, Japan and Kiva. They're still quite powerful. It's not really plausible to attack them. Well, I, I can't do it. It is plausible to attack them, but um, bit of a tricky war to declare. Who are these guys actually allied with? Serbia, Lithuania, Andalusia, Kiva, Belgograd. People that can hurt me, in other words. Um, Attila is a vassal of Cherson as well. I can always pick on Lithuania. I haven't done that for a while. Um, 
what would I take if I was uh, maybe Chelmno, I guess. Osterod, I'm really not sure. Osterod, yeah, just Osterod, I think. I'm at the point now where I don't really need to do really many major conquests. Could always hit the Kipchaks again as well. I probably will hit the Kipchaks again. I can see me taking like, yeah, what sort of oh silver in, Se in Severia? Okay, if I take like Chernigov in Severia, yeah, okay, yeah, I think I think I'll attack those provinces next. Um, Chernigov. Chernigov's pretty valuable. Oh, do I go Kakov? I might even just go Kakov actually. So, I'm going to do Kharkov and Severia, I think, is what I'm going to go for in the next war against them. Kharkov's valuable, it's got some decent economical value to it, I think. Use caution, always use caution. Um, economical. That's got a 4, and Severia's got a 4 as well. Chernigov's got 7, but I might leave that. What sort of items does Kharkov have? It's got silver as well. Oh, sorry, iron, not silver. Apologies. Um, it's got iron as well. Do do. Marienburg has been converted as well. Kill bands. Now, because we're a jerk, how much would that cost? 130. That will cost. How much is Orit Silver going to cost? A bit. So, if I convert the culture there, do Orotzilberg. I might just do those two provinces, I think. There's still some German around Germany. <laughs> I'm putting a bit of Pomeranian and Saxon. And there's a bit of Westerfalen as well, a bit of Westerfalen, a bit of German here and there. The Germans do seem to be everywhere though. Retzelberg's been converted. Kill Baines. Um, what about Kovno? Nah, it's too easy. Um, yeah. What about Kursk? Has Kursk been... Um, no, let's convert Kursk if we can. 101 months. I'm not going to be trying to convert Kursk, I don't think. Um, yeah. Lepetsk. Let's convert Mansur, I think. Only 27 months. Won't take that long, actually. Kursk will take forever, so there's no real point in trying to do it. What about Voronezh? 59 months, what about Lepetsk? 52, it'll take a while, those places. Might just be best off leaving it, I think. Do, do. So I'll be hitting the Kipchaks again. I'll probably hit Lithuania. Who are they actually allied with? They've conquered Pest, have they? Well, if they've conquered Pest, I might go for Chelmno as well. Who are they actually allied with? Serbia and Cherson. Well, what I might do is, is I might... Austria and Chelmno. Did they conquered a bit more as well? I think they might have. Um, give me a claim on Chelmno as well. I don't think I'll be using it for a bit, because I want to get manpower much higher, still if I can. I'm still at war in this other war as well, so... And I completely forgot, I need to send some troops over there to, to go assist. We need a good general as well. Two star, yep, two star. Sons of Kelava demand, demand nothing less. Send them over here, actually. Yeah, send them over there. 
It'll take them a while to get over there, but they'll get there. So I'm going to target Lithuania and Preet Kipchak for my last Wars of Conquest in the game. Assuming I have the time to declare war on both of them. I should. There's like another 12 years. I, sh I should have the time. I should have all the time. They'll take a while to get over there as well, won't they? They will. They will. I just want to go occupy those provinces myself. There's a lot of Abbasids over there and Asherons as well. Rebel uprising potential. What's going on with them? It's Garen Umbrin. No, they're tempted. Finnish revolutionaries. Got to put them down. 200. Didn't realize it was going to be that expensive. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have spent it. Oh well. Wait a second. Do I have military? I've nearly got military all the way up anyway. Can I afford to get some advisors? I can, but they're not cheap. So. Yeah, I might even. Uh, uh, not sure. That guy's born on the Cape Coast. Erky Erky. Erky Erky. I like that name. Don't know why. I just do. Provincial unrest in a bunch of provinces. Yeah, that's bound to happen here and there. Yep, that oh, that automatically called the province. Sweet. Um, send this one to Brazil then, and finish off that colonization. It was about time I finished it off. Too much relations, do I? Do, do indeed. Let me think. No, I don't have any conquistadors. Can't really do anything. Are they at war with anyone external again? No, they're not. It wasn't 90%. It's working well. Oh, they're nearly over here. Sons of Caliban reforms sent straight to Africa. Let's see what they can do. They're still taking their time, though. Like, do 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 do. Okay, let's occupy that province, I think. Yep, that'll work. Taking the time scare off the ships. Have you ever been in the ocean before? And that's an Adjuran fleet, and I really want to get away from that if I can. Because, if they move into that province, I'm doubtful whether I'll win. Yep, I'm not going to win that, so I'm going to retreat them immediately. Quickly, get out of there. I lost like f five regiments, was it? I did. That's really effing annoying. There's one lost six ships to go of that. Um, damn it. Ugh. Ugh. Why did that even happen? I don't know why it happens. Put the general over here. And take these soldiers and just march through their lands. So I'm probably going to hit the Kipchaks and Lithuanian in my last two wars. Uh, I've hit the Lithuanians for a few times, but I'm going to do it again. I'll have Chelmno and have um, Osterode, whatever it's called. Ooh, Adjuran's out of the war, are they? Yay, yeah, Azov's culture's been changed as well. I'm gonna win that battle for sure. Can't say I'm losing. Oh, and this war's over. Omar, Oman, not Omar, sorry. Oman will see the first of the Abbasids, and Oman will see down uh, these five other provinces of the Asherons. So they. Asherons were the big benefactors out of that. From what I can tell. We're going to wait until about 1812 to get a war with the others. We'll get in Skype call. Let's talk, talk to them later. I'm going to be closing down Skype. Oh. Um, Royal Marriage Author. Yeah, I'll accept that. Yay! Oh, they actually captured that province. I'm surprised. So we're going to march our troops over Lithuania, and we're going to attack very, very, very soon. 
France still hates me and they think I'm jerks. I think they're jerks as well, so it kind of works both ways. Um, Shelmano got the claim. No, wait a second, they've finished forming the claim, have they? Oh, good. Well, we should win the war anyway. I doubt we're going to lose. But, we'll leave that until 1812, I think. And got another colony done as well. Sweet. They're starting to expand themselves. Let's block off that area so they can't get into it. But anyway, that'll probably do for the moment though. I hope you all enjoyed yourselves. And if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as per usual, bye bye.